Good morning, Blessed Trinity, and happy Wednesday. Welcome back. Today is Wednesday, April 15th, and we are so glad that you are here with us for another day. At this time, please join us for prayers and pledge. Let us call to mind all of our personal prayers and intentions. Please keep the following members of our BT family and community in your thoughts and prayers. For staff members and their family members struggling with illnesses and health concerns. For all of our healthcare workers, first responders, essential workers, and the jobs that they're doing to keep our community safe and running. For all of our leaders, doctors, and scientists, working to find a way to stop the spread of COVID-19. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Through Jesus, God makes, God makes God's salvation known, not just to Jews, but to everyone. Today's reading tells of the Samaritan woman, recognition of Jesus as the Savior. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. The woman said to Jesus, I know that Messiah is coming, who is called Christ. Jesus said to her, I am he, the one who is speaking to you. Then the woman left her water jar and went back to the city. She said to the people, come and see a man who told me everything I have ever done. He cannot be the Messiah, can he? They left the city and were on their way to him. Many Samaritans from that city believed in him because of the woman's testimony. So when the Samaritans came to him, they asked him to stay with them, and he stayed there two days. And many more believed because of his word. They said to the woman, we know that this is truly the Savior of the world, the gospel of the Lord. Praise to you. Lord Jesus Christ. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Loving God, you created all of the people of the world, and you know each of us by name. We thank you today for Mr. Reed and Mr. Adonis Feliciano, who both celebrate their birthday today. Bless them with your love and friendship that they may grow in wisdom, knowledge, and grace. May they love their family always and be ever faithful to their friends. Grant this through Christ our Lord. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please face the flag. Attention. Salute. Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. We have a new Fun Friday challenge for you. So this week, our BT Fun Friday challenge, it's Furry Friend Day. So share a picture. We want you to share a picture of your favorite furry friend with us. So this can be your real pet or your stuffed animal, but your favorite study partner who's been with you while we've been home doing our distance learning. So it is Furry Friend Day on Friday. We want to make sure that you take a picture and send it, have your parents um, put it on Facebook with the hashtag BT Fun Friday or hashtag BT Grows God's Kingdom. So that is all of the announcements we have today. I'm excited to see your furry friends on Friday. And we do have our joke for today. Our joke comes from Isabella in first grade, Isa. And the joke is, why do oysters not share their pearls? because they're shellfish, get it? Instead of selfish, they're shellfish. It was a great joke, Isa. Hope you guys are doing well. Thank you for sending us your jokes. 
We look forward to seeing you back here again tomorrow. Remember, pray as if everything depended on God and work as if everything depended on you.